In this module, we shall discuss the two-step subgroup test theorem. A subset H of a group G is a subgroup of G if and only if the following conditions are satisfied. H is closed under the binary operation star of G. Number two, for all A belongs to H, it is true that A inverse belongs to H. That is, existence of inverse of every element of H is in H. Now we prove this theorem and we shall prove this theorem in two steps. First step, we will assume that H is a subgroup G and condition 1 or 2 prove. Or second step we ham iska converse proof karenge or usme ham assume karenge ke condition 1 or 2 hold kari hai or uh, h jo hai wo subgroup hai g ka the fact that if h is a subgroup of g then conditions 1 and 2 must hold follows at once from the definition of a subgroup jaisa ke aapne condition uh, jab h subgroup hoga g ka so condition 1 में आपके पास cloyer property जो है वो H के अंदर hold करेगी और condition 2 में existence of inverse H के अंदर hold करेगा. Now we prove the converse. Suppose H is a subset of a group G such that condition 1 and 2 hold. Condition 1 is for every A B belonging to H a star B belongs to H and condition 2 is that for every A belongs to H, A inverse belongs to H. These two conditions are holding and we need to prove that H is subgroup of G. By condition 1, we have at once that Cloyer property is satisfied in H. The inverse law is satisfied by condition 2. Therefore, for every A belongs to H, by 1 we have at once that Cloyer property is satisfied. The inverse law is satisfied by condition 2. Therefore, for every A belongs to H, there exists A inverse belongs to H such that a star a inverse which is an identity element e belongs to h by condition 1 because in condition 1 we are saying that the cloyer property holds and from condition 2 we know that if a belongs to h a inverse belongs to h so we have seen that identity element belongs to h and now we are going to prove identity law by a cloyer property e star a is equal to a which is equal to a star e it remains to check associative axiom for every a b c belongs to h it is true that a b within bracket into C equal to A into within bracket B C in H. For we may actually view this as an equation in G because associative property holds in G, it also holds for the elements of H. Hence, we have proved that H is subgroup of G and we have established the result.